he, he likes it. Okay. He likes it. Okay. I know you do. All right, welcome back. We appreciate you making American Idol part of your evening tonight. Have you seen your favorites yet? Perhaps it is the pride of Howard Meach. Here's Pia. I'm so excited that this week is Motown week because I've been performing these songs with my bands and they're just so much fun. There's so much soul, there's so much love. The song I'll be singing tonight is All in Love is Fair from Stevie Wonder's 1973 Intervisions album. But all is changed with time. This week I had the privilege of working with Harvey Mason Jr. and he really helped to make this song my own. There's just not singers like her anymore. You know, the, the quality of her tone and her voice and her control puts her in the category of other great singers. And that's unique and special. P was born with a great instrument. She's a powerful singer. We've all seen her hit all the notes. Now it's time to take all of her influences and turn it into her own voice. And this, this is a really good song to choose. The most important thing is when you get up on that stage, get out of your head. Right. That's good advice for me because I'm definitely in my head all the time trying to make sure everything's perfect, but it's not always about the perfect notes and all that. It's just about really feeling your performance. I feel like this song, it just gets me. So I right. feel like, I think I'll be less nervous. She's got to stay in the moment and not overthink it, because that's what can hurt her, is overthinking. There's no time for second guessing now. Performing All in Love is Fair, here's Pia Toscano. <laughs> so again, you kill us you. with one of your killer ballads. I mean, I'm gonna do the same thing I did earlier. You know, amazing vocals beyond check. Beauty, image, look, check. Feeling, check. Okay, now if I'm gonna give you any constructive criticism, I need now, because you can have a career like Celine Dion, like. Like the producer said, he, you have that special of a voice. You have that special of an instrument. Everybody can't hit those notes so effortlessly the way you do. So now, Celine gets on that stage, and it's, she owns that stage. She walks all over that stage. She stomps that stage. Do you know what I mean? And now, we've seen you sit there um, three times and, and do a ballad and sing it that way, and honestly just knock us over. Now I need, to, I need you to start incorporating that other part, that other dynamic to your performance. Mm. That's again, like Stefano, gonna take you over the top. I will, I promise. You, I know you can do it. 
I, we just need to see it. Absolutely. You know what I mean? We need to know it's there. <laughs> because yeah, you're amazingly awesome. And you're going to have to do a two hour concert one day. I'm looking forward <laughs> to it. Yeah, maybe three. Yeah. Listen, I mean, Jennifer's right. I mean, you know, you're phenomenal. I mean, you're beautiful. You've got the talent. You hit the notes. What I love is that you think of the note and you hit it just dead on. It's what amazing. I love that you did this time, though, is you incorporated so a little bit more falsetto in the beginning, so you worried it a little bit, a little bit more sensitive about yeah. the vocal approach. The only thing for me, if I have one criticism, Ballad, 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 come on. Give me a mid-tempo, <laughs> give me an up-tempo. I know you can do with that big old voice like that, you can do some other stuff. So the next time, bring something a little different to the thing. You know what I mean? I you can't live by ballads alone. You're right, you're right. I mean, you're doing, you're doing <laughs> amazingly can, well. She can, but she, she has to perform. <laughs> she yeah. does them amazingly well. Yeah, yeah. But we can't live on ballads alone. Give me a mid-tempo. <laughs> oh, I'll take that. You know what I'm saying? Stevie, what you think, man? I think that right now you are the closest star in this American Idol universe. <laughs> Woo! Hello. You are all that. You will be all that. I hear it in your voice now. You got it. If stepping out and putting your sneakers on and kicking some ass is what you need to do by then, yeah. well, guess what? I know you're going to do it. And so you, it's will. just beautiful. Thank Come you on. So yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Very regal this evening. And there was one more box. Dress, check. Nice yeah. dress, right? Yeah, image, beautiful, beautiful. gorgeous. Judges, check. The, Look, yeah, exactly. Check. Actually, check. the best seats in the house tonight happen to be the new ones back here. Take, take, a, take, take, a, take a look. Take a, take a spin. Here we go. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. There you go. Okay, and back. It's important that you see the couture around here in this show. Okay, yeah, yeah. For Pia, dial 1-866-IDOL-08, 1-866-436-5708, or you can text the word vote to 5708. Don't vote until the end of the show. Thank you very much, Pia. Thank you, Ryan. Well done. <laughs> Stick around, because Paul breaks out his guitar on this stage live right after this. For this performance, you know, I was really, I was out of my head. I felt the whole song. I connected emotionally with it. But I agree with the judges. I need to step out of the box, pick it up a notch, and use that stage. And I agree, and I'm going to challenge myself. If America lets me be here for next week, I promise you I'll show you more.